the winner of six Australian Open Championships, the holder of 14 Grand Slam titles, the world's number one player from Serbia, Novak Djokovic. Certainly a big roar for that man, Novak Djokovic. But Poi is about to undergo his biggest moment in the sport. Ladies and gentlemen, men's singles quarter-final action here on Rod Laver Arena. Would you please welcome from France, Luca Poi. Little momentum switches throughout that match, and Novak touched on that. Was down, it was one set all, he was down 2 1, love 40. Who knows what would have happened if Daniel managed to get the breakthrough there? The crowd were appreciative of such a good battle, and Novak showed his brilliance. And he showed it all the way to a four-set victory. To love coming back the other way for the performance that he was able to produce today. Looking anything but comfortable when he was down love three. He fought his way back into the match to take the first set. He took the first two. Raonic came back at him. But then the big man's serve went off when it was needed most. And Poi stuck to that game plan that he spoke about. Stuck to his guns. And now he finds himself in the semis at the Australian Open. Three hours and two minutes it was. Lucas Poi gets it done over Milos Raonic. 7-6, 6-3. 6-7-6-4. And that's an indication of how off-putting this man feels. A half volley wide, wide. I think he's going to put him right now, and he is. I'm called to Mr. Mr. Koi. Well, I, didn't, I didn't think that would happen, Jeff. That's a shame. Watch Lucas talking to himself just before impact here.